Landry Jones, seg seven, eight, <laughs> nine. Landry Jones, seg four. Eight. Landry Jones, seg four. Three, two, one. Welcome back. Sirius XM Camp Tour continues from beautiful Norman, Oklahoma. Seemingly, Oklahoma's always been close, but there's always that hiccup game somewhere. Yeah. You know, it's uh, the last couple of years, you know, the national championship has has typically had one team with one loss in there, you know, so it's it's tough to go undefeated, but um, we're definitely capable of doing it. Landry handles media and demands on his time and things away from football extremely well. That's that's never been an issue with him. And now that he's been the starter going on his fourth season, he's, he's well versed. Wide open schemes. As a quarterback, you almost got to lick your chops in some respect. Yeah, it's it's a fun, fun conference to play in, like you said. That took a little while to get used to just the, the pressure that you feel from outside sources and this place has won so many championships uh, the fans have gotten used to kind of winning and we had a 10 win season last year but you know it was a typically a down year for us you know so um, it's it's tough but it, it comes along with playing at this place on third down Jones fires right at the corner of the end zone touchdown the line judge says that's Broyles really put a big number up on the Longhorns right now. For my senior year, it came down for me as uh, really praying about it and feeling like what God wanted me to do. And uh, whenever I got peace about that, it was kind of decision was over. And then I thought about it a little bit more. It's just, I kind of want to enjoy my senior year. You know, I'm only taking one class this semester. Uh, I'm getting to have another chance at a, at a national championship and kind of go out on my terms and in the way I wanted to go out. With the first pick in the 2010 NFL Draft, the St. Louis Rams select Sam Bradford, quarterback, Oklahoma. I'm always a factor only in that I want my players to be informed. I, I'm not ever in a position where I'm trying to, to say you need to or don't need to. To me, it's more about be informed, get all the information correct and good information you can and then you and your family make the decision that you feel is best for you and I just don't I just have a problem when players make an uninformed decision that isn't in their best interest and then they end up disappointed where they end up picked. If you're going to go to the NFL and you're going to do all those things it, it will be there for you, you know and this is only a for me, it was only a five-year span of my life. Next year, I'll, I'll have a chance at, at doing things in the NFL, but as far as right now, I kind of want to be a senior. I knew he was going to make the smart decision. He was going to make a decision for him, so I wasn't going to go try and influence him in any way. I knew it wouldn't matter what I said. I always give him a hard time, you know, say, hey, you know, leaving me already, you know, last year. And, you know, I was excited. I thought it was, uh, you know, something great that he did, just texting me before he told everybody else that he was going to come back. And, you know, it meant a lot to me for him to do that, so I was happy. Dumb wide open Stills, touchdown! Kenny Stills in Oklahoma! You don't get that much time to reflect, and I can still remember the first day I got here on campus, you know, and it just it really does go fast, and it, and it moves, and all of a sudden you're, you're a senior and you're getting ready to leave. It seems like already some of the Big 12 quarterbacks from a year ago are already impressing everybody at the next level, and he's no different. He's, uh, uh, he's every bit what those guys are in throwing the football and, and more, so I think, uh, I think he's got a great future coming. Badger Jones, the end.